Alright, what we have here today is a typical SAT problem that involves multiple sections of algebra, specifically equations and exponential numbers. So let's see, we are asked to solve for x. Let's start from the left side. We see that there's a term repeating on the left side and that term is 5 to the power of x. Let's count how many times it is repeated. It's 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So on left hand side we have 5 times 5 to the power of x. And on right hand side we have 5 to the power of 21. If you recall, when you see 5 alone, it is actually 5 to the power of 1. So if you try to simplify the left hand side, we have to remember a rule. When you have the basis equal, you can actually sum the powers. So 5 to the power of 1 plus x is equal to 5 to the power of 21. Using the same rule, when we have the basis equal on each side, we can actually equate the powers to each other. Now, if we subtract 1 from both sides, we will actually get 0 here and 20 here. And in the most simple form, we will get x equals 20, which is answer choice D.